Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, today I want to show you my most recent Bonnie and Clyde haul. And if you've been watching my videos, uh, you know that I'm, I'm a Bonnie and Clyde fan. Well, I'm not, not of the gangsters themselves, but of the movie, the Arthur Penn directed movie with Warren Beatty. And um, I, I guess I'm well aware that it's a work of fiction and it's highly fictionalized. But uh, nonetheless, I, I thought it was a for uh, its time and uh, for what it was, I think it was a, a very groundbreaking movie and an interesting period piece. So uh, I do, whenever I, I find some kind of Bonnie and Clyde merchandise, I usually try to get it if it's at a good price. Now, I think I've already showed you this um, 1934 Ford four-door that uh, it's just a great little scale version of the car with the, the doors that open and the hood that opens and everything. And it comes with two little Bonnie and Clyde figures. You can get this from, uh, I, I believe it's... Um, Motor Mint uh, sells these sets. It was really cheap. I think it was six dollars and ninety-five cents. It was just a nice little set, and uh, the uh, I mean, it, it, they're not the best detail, but I think you know this is the only little Bonnie and Clyde action figures you can get. So for what they are, I think they're pretty cool. And Bonnie comes with a cigar, and they both have guns, and I just think it's really cool. Uh, this is a photograph of them right here. So. Um, Anyway, what I recently found uh, are two things. First of all, I was at Books a Million and uh, looking at their clearance, uh, they had some books outside of their store in a, in a clearance rack, and I found this for three dollars. It's called um, uh -oh, it's not down my fingers. It's called Go Down Together, and it's a um, biograph uh, biographical account of Binding Clyde, and it's very thorough by Jeff Gouin. It also, uh, I mean, it's got uh, almost 500 pages. Uh, he really digs deep, and uh, it has a lot of uh, photographs I've never seen before. And uh, like an early glamour shot of Bonnie Parker. She was actually a really, a really cute girl. Some of her journals that she wrote when she was in prison. Um, it's just a, a really interesting book. And I've been enjoying it. I've been reading it when I have the time. What else? The other thing I found is um, this uh, special edition DVD of Binding Clyde at Ross. And I picked this up for, uh, I want to say, $6. It was really cheap. Now, I'm not real big on the art. Uh, the art, to me, doesn't really reflect the movie. This looks more like some kind of serial killer uh, art or something. But uh, as you can see, it comes with a lot of extras. Um, is an ad to buy a poster. It comes with a press book. A photo book. Nice hardcover one. It's just really nice. And the DVDs themselves are in these nice cases. With uh, photos from the shoot. So, if you're a fan of the movie, I think you might enjoy getting this. And uh, it comes in a nice hard case. Uh, this paper will come off. And uh, as you can see, the cases. I don't particularly care for the design, but nonetheless, it's, a, it's an attractive case. So... For six dollars, if you can still find one at Ross, it's definitely worth it. For the movies, the special features, and um, you can freeze frame if you want to read about the special features that are on the set. So, um, yeah, if you if you're in Ross or Books a Million, and if you're interested in Bonnie and Clyde, uh, come check this stuff out, and uh, you might be pleased by what you find. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this review. Until next time, bye.